good Monday morning. This is pre-recorded as I am at a conference this week and um, the office was closed last Wednesday and Emily took some much needed vacation days. So this is pre-recorded, um, but all the content is still the same. So number one is a reminder that we do not have a July networking night. It is July 4th and we hope that you will spend time with your friends and family, enjoy Independence Day, and also our office will be closed both Thursday and Friday, July 4th and 5th. Uh, when we return July 8th, we will be excited to um, really kick off all the fall activities and events. They're all already on our calendar. You can register for everything we have for the rest of the year um, through the links on our um, email or from the website or Facebook. We have all of them ready for you. So a rundown of everything we have going on in the fall. August is back to school kickoff and so we will have a lunch and a breakfast that's all focused on education and we still have sponsorships available for both of those and you can register again online for um, to attend. We do need RSVPs for both of those events. September networking night, um, the first Thursday of September and we are looking for a sponsor. So we've uh, contacted a few people and the space just did not work out. But we had several people contact us after the banquet and again space didn't work out because September is so difficult to know what the weather is going to bring. We are requiring it to be indoors this year. So if you would like more details about sponsoring the September networking night, give us a call. Then September, the Ultra Financial Advisors Golf Tournament presented by Office Barn, September 16th. We are sold out of teams, 34 teams sold out before we can even have a golf committee meeting. But we still have lots of sponsorship opportunities, including opportunities for you to be on the course that day and see all of the golfers. Moving on into October, we will have our elected officials luncheon the first um, Thursday in October again. RSVP is required and we do still have sponsorships for that. And then the largest day in Lindell, Texas is October the 12th. We kick off that morning with the Ultra Federal Credit Union Harvest SO 1K, 5K presented by Christus Trinity Mother Francis. And of course, this year um, we are running or walking for the Lindell Library, the Lindell Education Foundation, the David Powell Food Pantry, and Meals on Wheels. So those are the causes that you selected in February. You can register now to run or walk. This is the most inexpensive that it's going to be all year. It is $15 until January the July the 1st and uh, then the prices will increase. So get your running shoes ready and get ready for a good cause. Then the rest of the day will be spent at Country Fest. Bigger and better than ever this year. Last year between 8,500 and 9,000 people came out and enjoyed and we're putting an even bigger footprint on downtown this year as we celebrate Country Fest. Uh, of course, our partners, the Kiwanis, the Library, uh, Cross, uh, Cross Brand Cowboy Church, Kaleidoscope, Life Source Church, and so many more will be joining forces to make it the best day in Lindell, Texas. So we still have vendor booths available. We have sold out of food vendor spots already, and there's going to be some great yummy food there. Um, but looking forward to having you all in downtown October the 12th. November will be networking night and December will be luncheon and breakfast. So the full calendar of events is online now. We're your partner in business for the last 40 years, and we hope you're renewing your membership now so that you can join us for all the fall events.